this weekend we're kicking off the school holiday fun with a bang. Rowan Atkinson returns to the big screen as the iconic British spy in Johnny English Strikes Again. To tell us more, Weekend Sunrise movie man Jason Jabber Davis joins us from Melbourne this morning. Jab, morning. Uh, what did you morning, think? Guys. Oh, look, I love these films. I think if you go to Rotten Tomatoes, you'll see all three Johnny English films don't get a great score, but you head along to the pictures with a 10-year-old kid and uh, Ruby's take on this film, this is hilarious. So he's back as the bumbling spy who seems to save the day in spite of himself. In this film, uh, Johnny is now a geography teacher after a mission's gone horribly wrong, but when the identity of all Her Majesty's Secret Service are exposed by a hacker, Johnny and his sidekick, Boff, are brought back into action to try and stop the diabolical cyber criminal with all the physical comedy we've become accustomed to. Let's take a look at Johnny English Strikes Again. We have a problem. Good. The identities of our serving agents have been exposed. The country is in a state of complete chaos. And the universe sends me you. Sir! Yes, all right, Buff, we're going on a mission, not a honeymoon. Yes, of course, sir. Uh, um. <laughs> yeah, so it's all the usual physical shenanigans. If you love Rowan Atkinson, then you know what you're in store for. Lots of laughs in a very silly spy story. Three and a half uh, stars for this one. I think there's great repeat value. I know Ruby's keen to see it twice. Okay. Um, also screening these school holidays from the Warner Animation Group. These are the guys that are very, uh, in large part, responsible for the Lego movies, obviously in conjunction with the great Australian production companies that are responsible. This is the story of Mego, who is a Yeti voiced by Channing Tatum. He uh, leaves his village one day and spies a human being, a.k.a. a Smallfoot, tries to convince the rest of the tribe that Smallfoot really does exist um, and it exposes a whole kind of web of deceit and corruption. Really fascinating film. Let's take a look at Smallfoot. Smallfoot! You might still be out there! And it fell from the sky! Gary, calm down. You know how you get. Okay, I'll try, but I'm just so scared. Son, it can't be true. Migo, you will be banished from the village until you are ready to tell us the truth. I know what I saw, and I'm gonna prove it! Is it too late to have second thoughts? Yes! So you've got a huge voice cast there, obviously um, uh, James Corden, he plays one of the human beings, Percy Patterson, who is one of the small feet, Zendaya's in there, there's a whole bunch of songs, gorgeous animation, um, it's a really, really beautiful piece with a really good message about maintaining your integrity rather than chasing fame. So mm. this one is uh, rated G, so it's perfect for the whole family, three and a half stars, uh, you can really kick off um, school holidays with a bang. Mm. Of course, Christopher Robin is playing as well, and next week we're going to have Alpha. If you want to know all about the great films playing these school holidays, check out Jabber's School Holiday Movie Special. It's on today in Melbourne and Adelaide at 11.30 and 1 o'clock in Sydney and Brisbane. You can also catch it on 7 Plus and 7 Flicks uh, repeating throughout the school holidays. Superb. So heaps of stuff to go see. Good Thank stuff, you so yeah. much. Thanks, right. guys. Thank you.